and I got some big piles. Big piles. Did you see it eat through those things like no one's business? Wow. This thing can take a lot. I'm impressed. Hey guys, Steve Sassman here, and I wanted to show you what the latest thing is that we're gonna do here on Tesla Income. This is actually the first edition. This is where we're showing you all the ways that you can make money with a Tesla. If you wanna find out more, please subscribe. But for right now, here, here's the snow plowing edition. Check it out. So this is the Tesla Model Y. That's right, the Tesla Model Y. This is the performance version. Not only did we get the performance version, but we got the white seats and we added this right here. This is a snow plow, obviously. Teslaplowing.com, check it out. If you're in the Flagstaff area, sign up and we will get you, we will get you set up to get some snow plowing done on your property. It's a very simple manual uh, snow plow. Right now it's in transport mode, as you can see. It's up here in the in the channel. To take it down, you just undo the pin, drop it down, and then it slides uh, on the actual ground and does the plowing. And so you do it in reverse. You just go back, backwards. And of course, with the Tesla, it makes it super easy because you've got the massive, huge backup screen uh, camera, which is right there. And it gives you a complete and amazing view of the whole situation going behind, so it's not a problem whatsoever. Sometimes you use the, the, the mirrors as well, but I don't have to do any cranking of my neck or turning around whatsoever. I just use the backup camera and it works great. Now, we're, no, we're, doing, we're not doing commercial property, just residential, but this is an amazing way to hopefully make some money if it snows enough here in Flagstaff. And that's the thing though, we're gonna be documenting it I'm gonna show you all the stuff that goes into it and we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully we get some snow. Otherwise, eh, it may not work so well here. Now there's a lot of markets where this could work really, really well, where there's snow reliably all, you know, all winter long. Uh, Flagstaff is not one of them. So it's, we're gonna be very dependent on the weather. We'll see, we'll see how it works out. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be fun. All right, guys, not only is this thing a snowplow, it's also a sports car. Zero to 60 in 3.5 seconds. That's faster than a lot of Lamborghinis, Ferraris, and all kinds of other sports cars. It's ridiculous, okay? Guess what? It's also a freaking hotel. Check this out. I actually slept in this last night because I was up in Flagstaff. I didn't have any of my cabins that were available. So I had to sleep in here. There it is. Completely perfect and comfortable bed. This thing is super soft, but nice and firm. And I am 6'3", my friends. That's right, I'm 6'3". I can stretch out completely, no problem, in this vehicle. It's nice and flat, it's super comfortable. And the best thing about a Tesla is, you're not burning, burning any gas, you can have the heat, in this case, or in the summer, you can have the air conditioning on all night long, and it keeps you perfectly comfortable. And there's no fumes, there's no nothing to worry about, so it works great. The Tesla Hotel, I'm telling you, it's a great thing. And there's this is not just me. There are thousands of people all over the world that camp in their Teslas on the regular when they're on road trips and stuff, saving money, not having to go to a hotel. No, you don't wanna do it every time. I mean, it would. You don't want to do it like, you know, five nights in a row. I typically would only do it one night in a row um, and then get a hotel or stay at a friend's or do whatever. Um, but it is a great option when you want to do it. All right, here we go.
check it out. This is it. Put the snow right over there in the ditch, which is fine. Got all this. This is a steep hill right here, so it can be a little sketchy, but pushed all these piles right off here. I mean, it's a lot of snow. It's a lot of snow for this little plow, and it handled it like a champ. I mean, look at that. Nice. This would have taken me hours by hand. And it took me, what, 15 minutes? And I'm not even going that fast. I could go a little faster if I wanted to, but I was trying to be careful. But there it is. That's the testaplowing.com. Okay, we're gonna put this back on. We'll show you how this works. Come over here, take these off. Grab this. Put it in the transport slot. Back down. Same thing on the other side. Take this out. This up. Transport mode. Boom. Now we're ready to roll. That's good. So that's it. Now we're in transport mode and we're ready to go to the next spot. Pretty simple. Teslaplowing.com, baby. All right, that went well. Yeah, that's pretty exciting. I mean, uh, gotta say that uh, I've been recording for 17 minutes and this would have taken at least an hour doing it by hand and it came out well. So uh, yeah, good to go. So please subscribe and check out our updates if you guys want to see what is going to happen with the plowing machine. It's going to be fun either way. It's going to be cold at times. It's going to be uh, it's going to be a challenge. There's definitely going to be some things that go wrong. Um, there's going to be some comedy, just in comedy of errors. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, hopefully nothing too bad, but uh, we will see. And it's going to be an adventure. It's definitely going to be fun pushing this Tesla to the limit to see how much uh, we can make from it in inside of one year. Hopefully that's the whole goal here is to see if we can pay off this Tesla, which is a $75,000 Tesla in 12 months. It's gonna be super hard, super challenging, but that's what we're here for and that's what this channel is all about.